Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in MVC5 instead of default template, how to install or add new bootstrap template in our project using bootstrap bundle. And here we got our new template instead of default one. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. When we create a new MVC project in Visual Studio, this is a default template theme. In this video, I will show you instead of default theme, how to install a new template and theme into MVC project. For this video tutorial, I am creating a new project. Go to File, New, Project. To add a new bootstrap template in MVC project, we need to add the bootstrap bundle template here. Right now, I have not installed the bootstrap bundle template. Let's install that one. Close. Cancel. Go to Tools. Below the Nudget Package Manager, the Extensions and Updates. Click that one. Click Online. and search for bootstrap bundle enter and notice the first option is a bootstrap project and item templates click download by clicking the install you agree with the above license terms click install And notice here there is a tick mark here which means the extension is already installed close go to file new project see here now in the templates the bootstrap bundle is added which is for MVC site I'm changing the project name to bootstrap template okay I got a window here welcome to the bootstrap bundle ASP.NET MVC project wizard from this project wizard one is a bootstrap example layouts or bootstrap templates depends upon your requirement you can select one of these options I'm selecting the bootstrap example layouts click next click next we can choose the layouts for our website so I'm choosing this one cursor click next after template we need to select the theme this is the default theme but I'm choosing the superhero click next my site name is MVC MVC master page click next and the last one click finish and our new project is created successfully go to solution explorer I'm expanding the views expanding the home folder index.cshtml click that one let's check the results the new template and theme is added to my project or not Google Chrome And here we got our new template instead of default one. 